hello hello guys uh, here we have an HP this is a nice HP uh, it's a uh, 6 640 okay let me check again I want to check here it's uh, where is the modern number okay it's 640 it's a uh, HP Pro book uh, 640 G2 uh, i5 it's not turning on let's connect to the charger again okay let's see see the lights here we have no lights as you can see it's not turning on even here on the power button when you press the power button it doesn't it doesn't turn on at all anyway let's uh let's check the board step by step Okay guys, uh, here we are, I have the board here, so how do we fix uh, dead motherboard, let's do a checklist, step number one, check your charger, alright, I don't think there's something wrong with this charger, because I was, uh, I was using it as well, but it's okay, we can go ahead, we can check the charger, how do you check a charger, it's simple, one probe on the ground, and then one probe inside, and we do get 19.3 okay there's nothing wrong with a charger step number two do a physical inspection let's go ahead let's do a physical inspection do i see anything suspicious here honestly yes yes i see uh, something suspicious Just dirty. See the pen? It's so, it's so dirty. There's a dust all over. But I would clean the pen if this PC is working, because it would be pointless to to clean to clean the thing. Only to find that the board as well. Only to find that the board is uh, it's beyond repairs. So right now, let's uh, let's clean. I mean, let's uh let's remove the bad guy but let's confirm now uh, using a multimeter okay let's do it together under the microscope here it is okay as you can see it's track track as well i was telling one of the guys uh, one of the guy on my um, telegram group i have a telegram if you do you want to join our telegram in your whatsapp group please let me know i was telling one of the guys from my whatsapp uh, you see you see and two of them not only one but two of them even the other one as well it's shorted even this capacitor as well this one it's shorted i can see it even this one is shorted but even this one is really shorted you can see the track you see so one of my one of the guys from my uh, from my whatsapp group he was saying uh oh i was telling them that you can uh, you can detect and see short capacitors and they they did agree with me and he was saying you can see them by color and i laughed i wanted to laugh because capacitors they come in different colors so you can't just say uh you know they they are shorted because of uh maybe i mean you, you can't just say they are shorted because of the color maybe they have a different color so he was saying they change the color if they are shorted of which is not true that's not true at all see these two capacitors here both of them both of them are shorted you can hear a beep and it's like the other side beeping away capacitors they beep one side one side see this one both side even this one will beep on both side this one is okay you know why it's because it's connected on the same uh, power rail with the shorted capacitor so that's why even this one it's shorted but it's not shorted i know it's working even this one as well as you can hear shorted even this one is just this is the main cause end up shorting the other one okay okay 
let's remove the bad guys but what what's you but then we let's cover this this how this how I cover okay. Okay, here they are. See how nice that is. Okay, what you do, you put. Okay, and then you take your take your fit gun. And then you apply it. Put flux, don't forget to put flux, guys. I flux is very, very, very important. You have to put flux. When you start, put your thing away and then put those, 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 those. Now let's focus. Turn out. I'm about the second one. Second one is out. Okay. See. Put some more film in there. Let's clean those pads. take your, your wig you need a wig to clean to clean the pads use a wig use a wig use a wig use a wig wire you press with the wig go back again press with a wig make sure they are clean yep Try to focus. Let's clean one more time. Hope you can see the dust. See the dust there. It's blocking uh, the holes there. It's mean that the the heat sink doesn't. Uh, it's not. Uh, it's getting cooled down. Effective. So what you do is you remove this dust. Okay guys, uh, before I put back everything, let's remove the old uh, demand paste. Okay, we'll remove it from here. And then, okay, let's use a clean section. And then what you do, take your alcohol, pour a little bit, and then make sure your things need a thing put there white spots and then you wipe on top of the of the CPU wipe on top of the CPU using alcohol okay let's do it again okay oh, alcohol and then you clean so what I have here is the demand paste. You apply new demand paste on top, on top, and then we are done. 
I believe. This is enough. Yeah, it's more than enough, it's fine. Okay. My charger is connected. Okay, it's turn on. I can see the lights here. It, the light is on. And there we go. We have HP, the machine. It's working 100, 100 percent. Yeah. Yep, I'm, I'm so happy. Uh, anyway, guys, uh, this is it. This is how you check. Or oh, this is how you repair a dead uh, laptop. You follow all those steps and then, yeah, you will be right.